Dog, wake up. Uh, Wendell. Hey, what what time is it? What day is it? What's this thing? I had a dream about aliens coming out of that geo. Wait, what? <sighs> Get it together, Wendell. Okay. TV. Baked fish. Um, place the fish on a bed of spring greens. Man, we need a kitchen. We need a kitchen so bad. Yep. Not that we have any time to use it, but we need one. Well, welcome back. Welcome you back. This is day seven. It's going to be episode seven and eight of summer. Um, I, you know what? Oh, we got a pepper. Pepper Le Pew. We got a radish, a radish, and um, a pepper, and a radish. We need to sell one radish to get a baseline prize. Boink. Take the co topaz to Gunther, Gunther, Gunther Tog. Mm, uh, wheat. We need wheat for Marnie's. We gotta buy Marnie's friendship or something like that. Oh, you forgot to paint your to put your picture. <sighs> Peter Piper picked a pick of pictures. Okay. Uh, yeah, I hear you, dog. Hear you. Okay, let's put these things away. Put, put it away. Step away. Cave carrots are forged. Let's keep them here. Let's grab these tulips. Yes, I remembered. I remembered. I remembered. I sure wish I'd kept that potato and stuff last time. But I didn't. Coulda, woulda, shoulda. Didn't. Coulda, woulda, shoulda, never did. Man, where am I put this picture? There we go. <clears throat> Copper ore. Nice. <clears throat> is that all from... That is all from... Um, Copper... Wood, stone, and clay. Oh, we're waiting on that. Let's do some watering. Our tulips this time. We're ready. Don't do that. Been a emotionally draining day for Dog. I know you don't care, but um, this old dog's got to clear out three decades of living and life uh, out of this old house. And uh, it's a far more exhausting process than I really believed it would be. Um, kids don't really have time or space to take care of old, uh, old things and I, I I kept everything, like slice of life things, like you know, not just report cards, but also uh, things the kids colored, you know, the little coloring, little cards they made, homemade cards. Um, uh, when my ex-wife moved out, she didn't seem to care too much about those things or, or that, or she hated me enough that she wanted to get out fast, right? So, in which case you can't blame her, but... Uh, she really did a smart thing in leaving the stuff here because it's it's something that's taken me years to process. Um, I've been steadily whittling away at the um, uh, the volume of 
personal family memorabilia I've kept over the years. Um, in part because I've gone through so many life changes that uh, I kind of wanted a record of who I have been, you know, and what we did as a family. But uh, it's time to skinny down those um, nostalgic assets and move on. Let's change that bug meat to bug bait. Boink. What else can we make? Uh, no, I'm not going to make any more tappers because I got to commission a silo. That's our first order of business. Go see Robin. Uh, we got to clear out. No, first order of business is clear out space. Buku space here. Before we go see Rock and Robin, anything back here? I'm not getting stuck on anything, am I? Okay. Oh crap! Look at the energy bar. Seventeen energy. What can I eat? I can eat a tulip. Okay. With good energy. Wow. <clears throat> uh, do I have... Yes, I do. Okay. Let's go see Robin. Before I change my mind again. Let's get the silo started. We'll do some more mining soon to... Um, why am I walking around with all this stuff? Donations. <laughs> Don't want to be walking around with that cherry bomb out in my hand. Not, not a good way to influence people. Win friends and influence people, dog. So, kind of spent my evening and afternoon. Uh, oh, oh, the baths. The baths. Oh, the baths. Robin, are you here, Robin? Hey, what's up, Robin? I got something for you. Really nice. So, you like that. Okay. I'm glad you like it. Uh, if Demetrius, if, if he's, where's he? I'll go give him one. Uh, I want to construct a farm building, Robin. Um, I understand you can build a silo, and I, let me show you where I would want it. <clears throat> I want it down on the edge of my property, um, right here. All right, thank you. <clears throat> Start working on your new silo first thing tomorrow morning. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Demetrius back here. I've got a flower for him too. Maru? Neither. Okay. They're out and about while you're working on the carpentry work. Okay. I get it. That's cool. Hey, you can eat a tulip. I wonder if... Um, yeah. Hey, sir. Hello, sir. Would you like a tulip? This is a great gift. Thank you. I'm glad you like it, Linus. I'm very glad you like it. I don't see Demetrius. Demetriosis. Oh man, uh, you know, particularly it's the um, mm, how to say this. A relationship that lasted a long time has been, is, I've had a lot of time to process it, okay? Uh, I'm sure you can understand that, but, but things that, dear friends who came and went, uh, acquaintances, oh man, look at my eyeballs, I'm like, oh, uh, look at that energy bar rising, fantastic, um, there are just, 
people and places in the past I just have to let go of. I used to keep a um, an envelope, a business size envelope, full of all little souvenirs, receipts, uh, tickets, and what have you of the places we would go on, you know, vacations and stuff, uh, special little family events and friends events and whatnot, uh, and photos of. Um, friends who are now ex-friends because we've had fallings out or whatever and they were a big part of my life at one time and you know I've got to I've got to skinny my house down just like I'm skinning myself down and um, and get on with life you know the next 20 years uh, instead of hanging on to that last 20 so so desperately so, uh, you know, I sound like a cheesy self-help book or something. Oh, speaking of books, here's a cheesy self-help book. A Lost Book. The Island of Lost Books. Fantastic. We need a little bit more reading material. One of the things that I threw out uh, today was... Um, let's see, which way are we going this way? A... Um, there was a time about... 15 years ago, I went through a terrific depression. I mean, a mind-bending depression. Uh, there were times I didn't think I was going to make it out of there. Okay, 15. Let's see if we can make 20 this time. Slimy. Oh, so much easier. Do we still have, have the uh, kill 20,000 slime quest? Can't remember. Emmanuel can't remember. Hey, fantastic. Let's go look, see if we got any copper up this way first. Nope. <clears throat> I'm also really curious. I'm still curious, those K carrots. There is one. And clay. Ooh, to replace the clay we just expended. Ooh, yes. I, I like this use of time. Um, oh, and I, what? An Omni Geode? More clay. More clay? It's almost more good than this. Um, I don't know. Do you do that? Do you save, like, uh, movie tickets when you go with buds and family, you know, friends and family? Um, movie stubs. Without those little physical reminders, how do you remember the things themselves? That, that's, I guess, I guess that's what scares me, is not remembering the things themselves, the events themselves. Uh, even if somebody were to bring it up, I probably wouldn't remember without those little tokens of remembrance. That really, really scares me. <laughs> yeah. My memory is not the greatest. I've always relied on uh, cheats like that. Things, items to trigger those memories. Fantastic. There's some copper. We're at level 16 only. Um, here's more copper, and level 17 is right around the corner. Oh, well, I don't care about you bugs. There ain't no bugs on me. There might be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs on me. Level 17. Nothing here. Put some bugs into shape here. Some slimes. Come here. Don't you be turning me green. Gratuitously green. 9.50 p.m. How are we doing with inventory? We got no inventory. Okay, we can throw out slime and sap. That's pretty low net value. Take care of this jerk. Also, um, being a writer, um, 
I tended to write a lot of my uh, feelings and whatnots over the years. Uh, and, oh, geode. Do I have, I guess I have space for it? Yes. Geodical. Uh, cherry bombicle. Let's, let's use this cherry bomb somewhere. <clears throat> Don't matter too much where, really. Yeah, I just, um, tough day, tough day. Enough said, tough day. The time is, oh, it's going to be craps. We started off so promisingly, and now it's already 11 o'clock. I had room for the scroll, yes I did. All right, well, let's get out. It's another failed attempt at level 20. But better to get home alive. Live another day. Midnight on the water. Midnight not on the water. No ocean's daughter here. Sometimes I miss that good old electric light orchestra, you know what I mean? Jeff Lynn. Hmm. I had one of their albums one time, and the thing at the time was to play the music backwards because there was messages in the music. Uh, yes, let's sleep through the night. So, playing the vinyl backwards. Level 2 combat, plus 5 hit points. Life elixir. Yes. Yes. So, playing the music backward on that vinyl record. Um, I think there's a song called Fire on High. Uh, you play it backwards. Good morning, Wendell. And it says, the message is in the music. Turn back, turn back, turn back. <laughs> so it's kind of a, a joke on the people who are... Let's talk corn. It's an unusual crop because it lasts for two seasons. That's right. While most crops die, corn lives on. Now get out there and plant some corn. Well, the most important reason to plant corn, of course, is um, the corn squeezins. So how do we make the moonshine here? We got some clay, we got stone, uh, pine cone, we got clay, we got stone, we got pine cone. We can make some more field to snack us. Uh, uh, what's a copper bar doing in there, dog? You know better than that, dog. Copper bar goes here. Boom, 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 boom. We got enough for two more copper bars. What are we going to do with it? <clears throat> That's a real good question. You got full full energy today, dog, so don't squander squanders it. Come on. Right. Dude, what the heck? What the? Wendell, what the heck? What is wrong with you? Wasting a lot of energy and water, freaking out, going backwards. I guess even if I could have just shared this stuff one time with the kids, um, gone through stuff, but they're just not at the point where they care about it. They're too busy creating lives of their own, you know? Um, I kind of sound like a classic, um, classic old, um, what? A what, dog? I don't know. I can't even say it. How much will this fiberglass rod? 176. Uh, I think the Dwarf Scroll 1 is already at the museum. Yes, Gunther doesn't need it. Uh, 
So let's um, put it aside. Do we need more tappers now? Is today the day for tappers? Mm. Let's uh, let's think later, dog. First, let's get the fields watered. Don't go staring off at the moon until the fields are watered. Moon gazing. Okay, we're gonna need to plant. Whoa, those are ready. Oh, that radish was ready. Okay, radish you. Okay, I need to sell a puppy. Sell a yellow puppy. We'll keep these two puppies. Sell a radish. Okay, and sell a dwarf scroll. Let's put uh, forage items up. Here, spice berry grape. Huh. For some reason, we're running short of sweet peas this time around. Mm, one, two, three, four. I guess at the end of the day, you know, you just got, all you really have is family and friends to talk to and re regale with old memories. And if some of those memories are lost, I, I guess that's okay, you know, I guess that's the way it is. In this digital age, maybe there's no reason for memories to be lost, but... Um, I guess things can be digitized, scanned, but it takes quite a bit of time to do scanning. I guess that's the thing too. Have I got one more? Oh. If um, these things are that important, why not scan them digitally, archive them digitally? Put them on CV CD, DVD, and then just, you know, delete the hard copy. Toss the hard copy. That would be a way to do it. Create huge PDFs. Uh, put them in the cloud somewhere. All right. Now it's time to go moon gazing, figuring out what to build. I do tappers. Uh, I could do a preserves jar. Turn vegetables into pickles and fruit into jam. Uh, cannot yet do a recycling machine. That's high on my list. A bee house. Cannot yet do a bee house. That's also high on my list. Um, very high on my list. The sooner we get that, the better. We need iron, though, which means we got to push down into the mine. We need crab pots, but I'm not spending that kind of money on crab pots. Three iron bars a piece? Uh-uh. Mm -mm. No way. So, iron is an emphasis right now. Recycling machine and bee houses. Um, the preserves jar, I'd love to do that. We've got some coal, right? It's wood, stone, and coal is all it takes. Wood, stone, coal. Let's do one. Let's do one right now. Let's put this copper here. Today we're playing with a preserves bin. Put it 
here. What can we put into this? Grapes? Spice berry? Hey, 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 spice berry jam. Uh, did I already plant? I think I already planted. Okay, we're done with the farming upkeep. Let's go check mushrooms. Uh, let's go to the bath and then to the mines. Correct? Correct? No, not correct. Go to town, dog. Oops. We got to take the roundabout way. Go to town first, I believe. Uh, because we need to see people. Check the count. Oh, um, corn dog, how are you doing? Oh, I was kind of heartbroken the other day. Um, there was a cute little puppy I met, uh, and it was feeling, it looked really down and scared, and I was invited to pet it, and I realized its ears had just been docked and were all stitched, and I thought to myself, that poor puppy, What? why do you need to dock a dog's ears? I mean, it's just, it just hurts, man. That's, I can, you know, necessary things are necessary, but unnecessary things are unnecessary. <laughs> Docking a dog's ears. Hmm. Especially when it's a puppy and it can't, you know, it's a puppy, man. Lewis, do you like tulips? Yes, you do. Got a little bit of a quest, maybe, here. I'd like a topaz. Demetrius? Yes, I so... I happen to have a topaz with your name on it, Demetrius. Oh, uh, Leah. Oh, ah, Leah. Caroline! Oh, man! Caroline completely, completely blocked... Leah's gift. Really nice gift. Okay, well, I'm glad you ladies like it. I found some wild fruits this morning. Sorry, don't have any left though. <laughs> okay, whatever. I'm okay with that. Pierre, for you? It's kind of you. I like this. Good. Everybody likes them. <sighs> Big dog spreading the cheer. What about... Uh, no, I don't have time for Gustavus. Um, I'll come back to you, Gus. For now, I need to go see Clint. Oh, wait a minute. Ma'am? Haley? For me? Thank you. Well, you're welcome. I don't even want to talk to you to know what you're going to tell me next. How much I smell or something like that. Well, Gunther, you're going to have to wait, my man. Uh, because somebody else wants this. Topaz named Demetrius. Demetriosis. Uh, something tells me, Clint, you're probably not into um, tulips. Esperite. Take it. Earth crystal. Okay. And some coal. Coal is awesome. Thank you, sir. I think Esperite needs to go to the museum. It does. <clears throat> So, Gunther, you get a little bonus anyway here. Gunther Tog. Monday the 8th. Donate to the museum. Boing! Okay, that's all you get today. I got another... I got a paying customer for this topaz. The Tale of Sir Topaz. By Jeff Chaucer, Esquire. Anybody else want a tulip today? Anybody else going my way? Demetriosis, what do I have for you? Boing! Yes, it is the topaz you requested. Here's a little something something. 
Yeah, that is a little something. But it's a lot more than a topaz. My ear shorts. Uh, would you like a tulip? It's a very interesting specimen. He liked it. <laughs> okay, I'm glad. See, everybody likes these tulips, man. <clears throat> Especially when it's summertime and it's a spring tulip and you saved it fresh just for them. Speaking of which, guys and girls, call your mom on Mother's Day. Call her and say hi. <clears throat> you know she misses you. Probably. Uh, did I already talk to you, Robin? Did I already give you something today? No, it was yesterday. That was yesterday. Hey, um, Abigail. Would you like a tulip? Hey, how'd you know I was hungry? <laughs> Girl, you are hungry all the time. <clears throat> My pet guinea pig, David, just hates this hot weather. Your pet guinea pig, David. Hmm. Well, I'm glad you didn't say your pet guinea pig, Wendell. That would have been pretty disheartening. Oh, um, Linus. Would you like a... He liked it. He likes it. Hey, Mikey. Do I have time? It's going to take an hour and a half. Bam. Oh, look out. Oh, golly. Stop. I want to get out of here. What? It just disappeared. Whoa, and it's coming back. What the crap? Who am I? What? What is that? I got another lost book. Why? What? Let's run up past the train. Choo -choo. I'm I'm here. Anything in the station? It's empty box. Oh gosh, I can't can't get back now. Zuzu City Bruisers. Hey, you got any diamonds? Diamond, because we both know what memories can bring. They bring diamonds and rust. What's that? A geode, a rock, a wood, an iron ore. Hmm. Oh, uh, by the time it's so cool. Damned if we do and damned if we don't. You know? We can always chop wood. Chopping broccoli. Back at the house. Look at me with my sandals on. Ladies, don't look. You don't want to see my buff figure. Uh, let's take a sip. I had to get a big old sip of wine today. Just to get through this day. Not the star due day, the real due day. A really dilly dilly day. There we go, 100%. I need a back door over here so I can get out of here in a hurry. I guess that's the point though. If, if, uh, if it was too easy to do this, get in and get out, it'd be really easy to, to abuse, wouldn't it? So an hour and a half penalty, which is a significant penalty here. So significant that I'm not going to be able to make it into the mines. But I got another book. Oh yeah. Hmm. What can we do instead? I think that gives us four iron ore total. Us, me. It gives me me four iron ore total. Saw something out here. Nine ten p.m. Hey, is Robin? Wait a minute. Is Robin done? Oh, she's still here. Hey, 
Be patient. I still have a lot. Of, I know. I know. Hey, take your time. Everything is all cool. Everything's good in the hood. In fact, this gives me a great chance to work on my wood chopping skills, my mad skills. Make way for the next structure, though. Yeah, this was a good idea. Not to force the uh, mining issue. But do this instead. Yeah, much better idea. Close to home, and we are. Did she quit? No. I'm like, woman, did you? Did you quit early? Which of course she did not. She's way too dedicated to do that. Okay, we still got more energy, but not much more time. Stop running around and just start chopping things down. I lost almost everything there. Trying to. There we go. Oops. Whoops. There goes tomorrow's energy. Well, we know how we can replenish, though. And let's get in here to bed. Well, uh, day eight of summer. Thanks for joining me. We're going to sleep through the night, and I'll see you again next time. Level three mining. New recipe, miner's treat. Pickaxe proficiency. Good. Really good work. Foraging. Ha, the dwarf scroll, scroll was only worth one gold. Okay, no worries. What was the radish worth, though? Radish. 99, actually 90 gold base. There goes that UFO again. Hey, we're here, we're here. All right. I'll put a break here and I'll see you again as we resume Stardew Valley.